Their answer is resounding, not yet. The CDC says we should still be keeping our masks on indoors in crowded situations. Chris just talked about the Washington State Hospital Association. All the doctors on that panel today agreed it's just too early right now. We still have about 30 people in Washington State dying every day from COVID. And the hospitalizations are down, but statewide it's only down 17% from last week. It's not a huge drop just yet. We still have FEMA and uh, the National Guard at some hospitals. So I spoke with Dr. Larry Corey today. He's the virologist from Fred Hutch, who is really right there alongside Anthony Fauci in all of their discussions every single week for the last two years. Dr. Corey told me basically the same thing. We are not in the endemic state stage yet, not by a long shot. We still are above, you know, close to 2,000 deaths a day. I mean, that's like saying, gee, you know, we're going to have 500,000 deaths this year. And that's, that, that, I mean, that, and you're saying that that's endemic? Now, that, that's not, that, that doesn't meet my definition. And I would, would charge all the governors who are looking at this to sort of say, what, what are the data there? And he also talks about it's not just about the deaths, but even focusing on that. He says, look, when it comes to masks, kids are generally better at adjusting to it. You know, my daughter, same thing. She's kind of more used to it than we, than we are as adults. He says, besides vaccines, masks are the number one way to prevent the spread of uh, COVID-19. And until the numbers come down and the data supports it, he thinks we should still be wearing masks indoors in large settings. Guys.